how to fly a helicopter. Greetings people, today we're going to teach you how to fly a helicopter, so let's start. Steps to understanding how to fly a helicopter. First, in the previous video, we taught you how to understand the controls of a helicopter. Today, we're going to learn to fly that helicopter. Second, make sure that you're properly jacked in and comfortable on your pilot seat before takeoff. Third, begin by slowly opening the throttle until you reach the proper operating RPM. Fourth, the next step is to gradually pull the collective upwards. Fifth, push the left pedal as the collective pitch increases. Sixth, make sure that you adjust the pedal in case your aircraft is turning left or right. Seven, Gradually, your helicopter will leave the ground and you'll be able to use the cyclic control. 8. Adjust the cyclic to level the aircraft as you take off. 9. Gently push forward the cyclic to start moving forward. 10. When your helicopter will transition from vertical to forward motion, it's highly likely that it'll shudder and the noise will begin to go up. 11. In that scenario, push the cyclic forward a little more to make sure you keep going forward. 12. The rotor blade lift will become more effective as the speed increases. 13. Gradually reduce the collective lever and apply less pressure to the pedal. 14. Make sure that you slowly push the cyclic forward to avoid a reduction in forwarding speed. 15. Once you've completely taken off, slightly release the forward cyclic pressure. 16. Take your helicopter into the hover phase by finding a balance between the collective, cyclic, and tail rotor controls. 17. Make sure that you stay aware of the time lag between your adjustment of the controls and the helicopter's actual reaction. 18. Make sure that you climb and descend using speed according to your pilot's operating book. 19. When you're ready to land, make sure that you sight your landing spot on the right side. 20. Bring your helicopter to 2 to 500 feet above the ground or any obstacles when you're within a kilometer away from your landing area. 21. When you're 2 kilometers away from your landing area, slow your aircraft to 40 knots and begin to descend. 22. Keep an eye on the descent rate and make sure that your vertical speed doesn't go over 300 feet per minute. 23. Adjust the vertical speed using collective. 24. When you reach the edge of the landing area, gradually slow your helicopter down to 30 knots and then 20 knots. 25. Gradually move your nose up to decrease the airspeed. 26. When you get to the landing area, make sure that you keep moving forward. 27. Once the landing spot is exactly beneath the nose of your aircraft, start reducing the collective. 28. Engage the parking brakes. 29. Gradually ease the cyclic to reduce momentum and then forward to level the altitude. 30. Make sure that you keep the descent rate as low as possible. 31. After making contact with the ground, recheck your parking brake and then reduce all power. Note, this is just a guide towards understanding the operational controls of your helicopter. This doesn't give you any authority or certification to fly an airplane or a helicopter. It's highly recommended that you go through proper training with your instructor before flying. This is it guys, make sure you go through all these steps thoroughly before getting into a helicopter. Nonetheless flying. Share with us your experience in the comments section down below. If you like the video, hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel.